But if you close your eyes Hello awesome people, welcome back to Airport CEO season number 3 episode number 2 if you want to know more about this series, then please go and watch the episode number one if you haven't, because there is uh, there I explain about what we're going to do with this airport and what, where, what the plans are. Um, basically, what we did in the first episode is make a layout with uh, all the runways of all the taxi foundations that we have for now, because we're going to add lots more. Uh, we have a small terminal building over here, the start of it at least, and we have some parking spots and some subway stations and everything like that. Um, we do have an email. What kind of email do we have? A goal? Okay, that's just spam. Um, and we have some some general aviation over here. Now, we are running low on money. So we really have to find a way to get more money um, in the bank. And that's basically what we're going to do this episode. What, basically what we're going to try. Um, and what I want to do is I want to try and build the... Um, I want to try and build more general aviation for now to get some money up and up in there and then go on and uh, make the terminal. That's basically what we have to do because we have uh, so we have put in so much money um, in this uh, in this airport for now that we have to do this. Um, so yeah, let's go and try this. Uh, I don't know if we can build once we have nothing. I don't think we ha we can. Um, so let's see. Can we have uh, more loans? Can we have uh, some more loans? No, we can't. Uh, okay, so th this thing has changed. Normally, you could you could choose, and you could even get free loan, uh, free loans. So that's a bit of a bummer. Um, I have to find a way to do this. So if we do, hopefully we can build some aircraft stands. Probably not because we have no money. No. Um, okay, so what we have to do is we have to wait until we get our money back, basically. Well, that's a good start of the episode. I'll see you back when we have our money back then. And welcome back. We finally are in the green. We are quite a bit in the green, actually, because we need some money to build. And uh, I don't want you guys waiting on that. But it took uh, quite a while before we actually got into the green. Uh, I opened up all these other runways so that the uh, general aviation can land and um, and fly away here. Depart from, here. depart from here. Because that's basically what gives you the most money. If they land and if they depart, that gives you like 400 bucks. And if they're standing here and just, uh, you know, renting out this stand, it, it gives you 13 bucks for half an hour or something like that, um, which is not the best. Um, it, get, it is extra money, but the most money to be made from general aviation at this point is uh, by landing and by departing them. Um, so I opened up all these uh, runways so that could actually have, we could actually have more aircraft coming in and going out at that point. Uh, I added some some stopping points over here so that we have a better traffic flow. Um, I, I deleted this uh, this uh, stopping point that was over here because it was def definitely holding us up. Um, and yeah, we're making money. And as you can see, uh, well, it's, it's becoming night now. And at night we sort of break even because we don't have planes landing or de uh, departing. At least our, our thing is full. Uh, our stands are full. So uh, we're going to break even uh Slightly, I guess. Well, we're gonna actually do a little bit better in the first hour. Um, but the second hour is probably gonna we're gonna break even a little bit more because this this has some planes that we're landing to. Um, so yeah, but we have some more money, and that means we can start building again. Um, for now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go back to F10 and put put uh, simulate construction at uh, no. Because, like I said in the first episode, I want, I want to build up something and uh, we're going to do the interior design and stuff we're going to do with simulate uh, building. But for now, I just want the, these big blocks that we're going to build. I don't want you guys to be bored with that. Um, so yeah, we're going to build another big block here. Um, and we need to go up quite a bit, actually. Um, let's go up like 20 and um, let's do 50. That's 200,000 bucks. Well... That's quite a big, big chunk of money, but, whoops, but if we delete this one now, we have a big opening over here, and this, this is going to be our sort of main terminal, and then we're going to have these side arms that go out, extend to out of here, um, but we also have to have a place for the road, the service road that's coming in over here. Um, so what we should do, another spam email. So what we should do is we probably are gonna change this around. Um, let's uh, let's start with doing that. By the way, so I actually know where we're going. 
So contractor site is, uh, let's put it over here. And let's uh, put the loading site over here. And let's then delete all of this. All of this can be deleted. And this is going to be extended into a service road later on. Um, so we can actually easily get there. Um, should we do that now? Yeah, why not? Let's do that now. So we do a public road, like uh, five, like four tiles, I guess. Something like that. And we do a vehicle checkpoint over here. And then we're going to do a service road, which is going to be a concrete for now. Like this. And uh, we're going to change it up. We're going to... Uh, connect that to the stands and all the other stuff that we need to. Uh, we're gonna have the, uh, the, the like the oil, the fuel uh, depots over here and the vehicle depots over here. But that's gonna be later on when we actually know where to place them. Now, um, we have to measure this out a little bit. Let's start off with measuring out where we want to have our aircraft stands. Now we want to have medium aircraft stands. That's what, that's uh, where where we want to start. So. Basically, if I want to start like over here, which we can, um, we have one, and uh, and now we have insufficient funds. Well, that means we're gonna wait a little while again. And uh, but for now, what I'm gonna do is, this is can we do a taxiway foundation in the middle, like this? We can actually pay for that. Let's let's do that. And that's basically all of our money gone. Now, let's connect that up to the taxiway foundation, the actual runway. And that seems quite cool. Let's actually have a holding point over here. Well, actually not over here, by the way. Let's, let's put it over here. Um, and we can open this up for commercial uh, flights later on. And they're only going to use this one, because that's the only one that is available for medium aircraft, uh, medium air flights. Medium aircrafts. Just learn how to speak, please. Uh, <laughs> but I want at least. Uh, well, this is actually quite. A, this is actually quite weird. Uh, this is not gonna work because we can't extend the extend the arm. So uh, let's start. Sorry, we should demolish this, and we should also demolish this. So I made a mistake. I made a boo boo. Well, we're gonna change that up. Uh, that's a lot of money gone, though. You don't get any refunds in this game, which is. Uh, yeah, it is realistic, and uh, but it was my mistake, so yeah, yeah, not a not a good thing to do. So we have to first think about our foundation. So how much is this foundation going to be? So if we want a foundation over here, that's the first arm. Let's make it like uh, six wide, I guess. Six wide. Okay, we have to acquire some new funds. So uh, I will see you when we have acquired some more funds. Be right back. Okay, and we're back. So what I decided to do was I, I decided to take a, a loan and uh, you know wait late, wait a little bit on the um, on the profits of the general aviation, and we actually got a million from that, which is basically a lot. Um, and yeah, if you if you leave the game running long enough, then uh, you're fine if you if you are making a profit. Uh, but sometimes it takes a long while. And but now at least we have the money um, to start building what we want to build, and that's basically what I wanted all along. So what we're going to do is we're going to at least extend it towards over here, I guess. And we're going to bulldoze this bit. Bulldoze that little bit. Um, that should be sufficient to get a security port, uh, security uh, thing in. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be fine. Uh, aircraft stands. Let's add one, two, and uh, three. But that would... Hmm... Probably not a, f uh, a third one. No, we're not going to add a third one. So that means we can delete um, this bit. And we can actually get rid of the foundation there. Um, get rid of all that foundation. And uh, build a wall. Can we please build a wall? Thank you. Build a wall over here. Um, this means that we have two aircraft stands on this little arm. Um, and we're going to have, uh, of course, a taxiway foundation. So, taxiway foundation. It's going to be asphalt right away. Although it is quite a bit of money, we're going to add in the asphalt. And uh, what we're going to do is, probably we're going to add in... Um, 
Am I doing this right? Yeah, I'm doing this right. Another little runway over here. A little, another way to actually get to this point. Um, so yeah, that's basically what we're going to do. And uh, the next arm is going to be like uh, air crescent, air crescent, arm. And then on the top side will be another air crescent, air crescent. So the next arm is going to have four air crescents on it. Now, before we go any further, I'm going to rename these ones. Because this is the first one. This is the, the Daco Giannis... I hope I'm spelling this right because I'm doing this totally from memory. Uh, gate. And the second one we had in the last season was the Joe Boss. Whoops, the Joe. No, nobody saw that. <laughs> the Joe Boss gate. Uh, and these are going to be our two new gates. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect them up. Uh, do this and this. And we're going to have this little connection over here. Uh, and add these. They're not going to stop for anything because they, they should have the... Um, the leeway to actually get to this one first because they're commercial flights. Uh, that it does, I know it doesn't work like that in the game, but it should be, um, in my opinion. Commercial flights should go for general aviation. Uh, I just opened that one. I just didn't delete it. Okay, so delete. Um, so what we're gonna do here is we're gonna have the boarding desk. We're gonna, we're gonna have a seating area. Just a small little thing. This is gonna be like a very small, easy uh, terminal or gate or whatever you want to call it. And this is going to be the actual thing where we have the toilets, the restaurants, the shops, everything else. And we're going to have some security in the middle. Um, so basically that's what we're going to do. Uh, we still have quite a, money, a bit of money left, which is good because we need it. Um, what we have to do for now is at least get a service road up and running to, I guess, maybe over here. So they can turn around here and they can go into here. And then can, they can actually go to the, to the other side too. Um, so that should work out fine. It's a little bit crooked here, but yeah, well, we need to do it. We need to deal with that um, because I don't want to have another cross over here, so that cars will just block off this little bit. Uh, so we need to deal with that. Uh, these are connected, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna uh, go to areas and we're gonna make this area secure. This area is gonna be secure. Uh, and we have to get the security. So I'm going to do this uh, without the building simulation. And the next part is going to be all with building simulation. So after this episode, we will have building simulation on forever. Uh, medium airport security. I guess that's good enough. We could actually add... No, we can add a few though. Let's... Uh, the thing is, we also need to add one other one uh, for the staff. So we're going to have this one. And we're going to have a smaller one for the staff. And that's going to be right here in the corner. Um, so we're going to have walls, of course, to separate these. And that's basically gonna, going to be it. Now, uh, for, for the coloring of the flooring and everything, uh, you can leave suggestions in the comments. I'm definitely going to look at those. Um, but for now, what we're trying to do is not do the coloring of the flooring. We're, we're just uh, setting up... Our, our, our sort of airport so we can actually gain get uh, start getting some money with the commercial flights because that's basically what we want now we have this over here so we need some more items we need a boarding desk of course uh, which is gonna be uh, like right here in the front I guess and the same thing goes over here so we have the boarding desks which are connected to these ones which is pretty good uh, open stand can we open it yeah we can make it commercial that's very good open it and make it commercial so that, that will generate some contracts for us now, which we can accept later on. Um, so the other thing that we need is we need check-in desks and we need um, um, a secure area. Ooh, of course, we need a secure area exit. So that's... that's uh, we could put it over here and just have this as a wall. I guess that's a better thing because then we can use this part to actually build something, like a shop or something. Um, so the secure area exit is going to be over here. So we have exit, and that divides the uh, the security and the actual uh, security for the for the people that are coming to work here. Now, uh, employees. That's that's the word I'm looking for. Now, uh, next thing we need, we definitely need some check-in desks. Now, the check-in desks. Uh, where are we gonna put those? I guess on this side. Well, maybe we could have the check-in desk like uh, on this side down here. And um, so that they come in, we will have a small info uh, area over here, then have the check-in desk, like a whole row, and we can have like a second row over here and over here if you want to. 
have a small opening after opening in the middle with like toilets and uh, probably uh, seating areas and then we go up in here where, where they actually go into the security and into the actual um, gate or just have some shops and they can run out to the next gate and the next gate and the next gate and so on so probably that's what we're going to do so we're going to start with um, let's gonna let's let's start with this one check-in desk now let's start with two and the queues we're going to build later on we don't really need queues right now we don't have any passengers so why should we have queues now i'm not going to build the information desk yet because that um, requires airport staff to, to permanently be there and that's not what i want um the other thing that we're going to build right here is probably staff rooms and stuff like that um Probably will have like a nice little bit in the middle with bathrooms and staff rooms and everything, offices. Uh, that's that's probably what we're going to do. Um, so we have our first thing ready over here. Let's let's start with some gate seating. Uh, I want the double row, definitely. Uh, and uh, we are going to start with some gate seating over here, over here, here, here. And uh, basically, this is where all the people come to weight on the flight uh, so they need a lot of seating we have medium uh, medium flights and we're gonna plan them in quite nicely whoops um, so we have these which is basically good enough we can have some toilets in the middle maybe a little uh, snacking area over here somewhere uh, maybe a few little shops um, that's the other thing that we're gonna do we need to hire people so we can actually do that um, I want to get the shops already because that is gonna give us a lot of money um, and it's going to be one of our main profit makers at the start. So we need to hire, uh, where is it? Staff shifts the board. We need to hire a procurement director and a strategy director, I think. <laughs> yeah. Um, so staff filter by all strategy director view applicants. Just take the cheapest one. Uh, HR director. No, we need to procurement director. Sorry. Uh, take the cheapest one. And that should open up some new options here. Yep, it did. So, shop upgrade, food franchises, night flights, ooh, but that doesn't, that doesn't work for general aviation, I think, so it doesn't really, uh, really matter for now. We definitely gonna ha have them once we have, uh, the ability to get our first commercial flights in. Uh, but for now, we're gonna pause the game, uh, for a little bit, because we are ready to get our first passengers, and that means that at the end of this episode, we're gonna do some flight planning. And we're going to start tomorrow. Uh, so we have restricted times. I'm not going to use the auto scheduler. Um, but first, we also need to get some contracts, of course. Uh, so the goal was to get some um, some contracts for each stand. That's basically it. I'm not sure if we can actually do that. Because there are a lot of different uh, companies. And, um, you know, performance is also an issue. So, uh, <laughs> yeah. Good luck. Um, but what we want to do is we want to have some uh, some cool... Uh, ones coming in now. Let's start with uh, something like Havana. I think I don't think I had Havana in the last series uh, So let's start with Havana um, So let's sign you uh, And that's gonna be for this one and the other one is gonna be whoops. I clicked it away uh, the other one is gonna be like um, Fly penguin so we have Havana, which is basically like uh, it sounds uh, Very Caribbean and we're gonna have fly penguin which which sounds very Arctic Um so yeah, we have hot and cold in our airport, basically. <laughs> What's this? It's a white tree. Okay. Is it dead or is it... It's not snowy, I guess. We have another one over here. Weird. Um, so basically what we're going to do is we're going to do it to the flight planner. Go to tomorrow. Check out our Havana ones. Flight's not offered yet. Flight's yet not offered. That That's a, bit, a little bit weird English, but still. Uh, please wait. Okay, so we have to wait until these flights... So, yeah, let's wait until the flights then. Hopefully they will be offered soon. Nope. Nope. I don't know how long it will take, but for now, let's just do that. Um, okay, just so you guys know, I'm going to put Simulate Construction back on. Um, because, like I said, I, I, I said in this episode, we're going to put it on once we have built everything that we have, uh, have to, uh, which is necessary. And we basically have that right now. So, I'm not going to waste uh, more time uh, by by doing not doing sim whoops not doing simulate production we're gonna make a whoops a nice little queue here 
which is gonna be um, well it doesn't have to be that long I guess this is this is probably fine we're gonna have a nice little queue here for the um, for the other side for the uh, for the employees uh, we have some email probably yep spam um, flight planner oh we have a quotation mark here blinking so that's probably uh, okay no we don't have any flights yet which is weird <laughs> Uh, oh, do we need a better aircraft? Uh, do we need a better tower for it? I guess... No, it doesn't say. It doesn't say that we have... To have a better tower. But, maybe it says right here. Because we have the simple tower, because we had general aviation. Um, uh, where is it? ATC tower. Uh, small one. Let's have a bigger one too. Let's put it right here. Why not? Yep. Sure. Fine. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Let's put it right there. We may we might delete this one at at some point then. Um. Oh yeah. And now that I have enabled it, I also have to get some contractors. So let's deploy like twenty. Flight why is it blinking if I can't do anything? It's 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 just totally stupid. Come on. So another spam? No, receipts. Shop and food franchises are in. Well, that's something we're gonna build later on. Uh, not now. Um, next stop is probably gonna get this running and then uh, bathrooms over here and over here somewhere. Have staff rooms over here, all that stuff. And then we're gonna probably build some shops and restaurants to make sure that this uh, this is good. Uh, people enjoy their stay over here and also over here because we are gonna add like a smaller restaurant and so and so on. Um, and once that once that is done, we are probably making money and we can go for uh, something else so that we can actually have uh, these uh, the, the the very good gates. Um, and we have our aircraft. We we'll probably can destroy this one now. It was placed a little bit weirdly because I just pop popped it in because uh, I wanted to have some general aviation because otherwise we would go bankrupt. So yeah, um, that's basically what we want. They're gonna delete this. We have the bigger one, which is awesome. Hopefully that will help out with the medium flights. Uh, I'm not sure. Maybe it was that one. So fly penguin, you are gonna get uh, next day. You are gonna get five o'clock confirm. Uh, and we need to go back to Havana. Havana hasn't yet any has hasn't offered yet any medium flights. So the other thing that we need for now is we need a building, a vehicle depot, which is going to be placed over here, I guess. Yeah, I guess this would be a good option. And then we could extend the service road over here and then have the fuel depots over here. That's probably our best bet right now. So vehicle depot uh, and. We are gonna, of course, get, where is it, where is it, operations, operations, no, it's economy, uh, economy procurement, and we're gonna get a small push force, blah, 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 truck, one. Oh, we, we first need to have that, a vehicle depot, okay, so I might, I'm, I'm gonna do that in this episode, otherwise I'm totally gonna forget that, uh, that that need, needed to be done, so, get our workers up there, please. Can we please have a light? Yep, we have a light. Basically, I want you guys to finish this. We can uh, then get the vehicle and that's basically it. You might want to do some research though. We might want to go into operations and... Um, of course, we also need to hire some people, but that's going to be in the next episode. Um, where is it? Economy. I was searching for economy. Yeah, Jet A1 fuel service. Bam. Unlock now. Uh, we don't need to do that. Order one, and that's basically it. Um, so yeah, this is uh, our new airport, uh, episode number two. It took a long while to record this because I was, uh, you know, I was AFKing a lot to get our money back up. But uh, yeah, it's actually we 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 are starting to get a working uh, airport right here, and that it's pretty darn cool. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have enjoyed, then please leave like and or a comment. And if you haven't, please consider subscribing to the channel to help the channel grow. And of course, to follow this huge airport CEO series. Uh, as always, I've been Ibo and you've been yourself. Thanks for being awesome. Thanks for watching.